Today's show. On today's show, I want to take a little visit to one of my favorite locations that I've ever been to, the American Southwest. Today, we're going to learn about the Southwestern Native American tribe, the Hopi. On today's episode, we're going to discuss the region, climate, landforms, plants, animals, food, clothing, shelter, travel, and culture of the Hopi. The Hopi are a Native American tribe, often recognized for populating the North American continent and in particular, the state of Arizona, where the climate is hot, very little precipitation. The Hopi were pedestrians. They were walkers. The only method of transportation necessary for the Arizona desert is walking. Where the Hopi lived, there was a diversity of landforms, consisting of mountains, rivers, plateaus, but little to no grass. In the American Southwest, where the Hopi lived, there's a wide diversity of plants and animals. Plants consist of cacti, including the prickly pear, saguara, old man, and barrel. Animals familiar to the Hopi include the mule deer, jackrabbit, desert tortoise, mountain lion, and fox. Foods that had been modified to grow specifically in the hot desert of the American Southwest consist of pumpkins, squash, corn, and peas. In addition to beans, the Hopi have been known to grow blue corn. The Hopi, like many other Native American tribes, were experts at utilizing their physical environment to meet their needs for clothing. They utilized the cotton that they grew to make shirts and pants, and any deer skin that they came about, they would utilize the skins to make leggings and moccasins. The Hopi utilized their physical environment to meet their needs for shelter, the Hopi tribe live and lived in adobe houses that are also known as pueblos. They're suitable for the warm, dry climate in which they live. The adobe or pueblo homes are multi-story houses made out of adobe, which should consist of clay, straw, and pebbles. Just like you, I, and all of our friends, we're proud of our cultures. The Hopi are proud of their culture too. Hopi culture consists of basketry, dancing, singing, etching, such as petroglyphs, painting, jewelry making, weaving, pottery, and basketry. So in conclusion, let's take a moment to reflect upon the ingenuity, the greatness of the indigenous people that inhabited the early United States long before the Europeans came. They were experts at innovating and accelerating their use of their physical environments to meet their need for food, clothing, and shelter. I want to thank you so much for watching. Feel free to connect with us. Check us out on Teachers Pay Teachers. Follow us on Instagram, like us on Facebook, and check out our Pinterest page. If you like this video, hop on over to our YouTube channel where you can check out many exciting videos like the one that you've just seen. Check out our blog at www.bowtiegamwife.com. Click, 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 click